Welcome back to City Skylines and welcome back to Sins Arcade. Before we begin, uh, this is going to be an open Discord. Um, hey, it's Shivel, Diavante, Culinary Zest, SK99. If you guys are part of the, the Sins Arcade Discord, not that you have to be, but if you want to be, I am leaving the voice chat open and as long as you can behave yourself um, accordingly, please join us inside a voice chat and you can be on the stream as well. The link is on now inside the chat there for you guys too. Before we get into way, first and foremost, my name is the Lord of Sin. This is Sin's Arcade, and we are currently uh, con continuing our current play, which is Crook County in City Skylines 2. Last episode, we uh, went a little depth in depth on uh, in debt, excuse me, um, because the building in this is much different, much, much different than it was inside of City Skylines 1, in a bunch of different ways. The economy is dramatically different than it used to be. Um, the cost of assets is significantly different from what it used to be, and so therefore trying to balance your budget accordingly is going to be very, very tough. At this point, the only other option I have to try to see if I can try to balance this budget, because we did take a loan out, unfortunately, and we are currently paying back that loan. Uh, at this point, it's an interest rate of 6.1%, with a total amount of, of 200, it was 250,000 we gained. Hey, there's a raid, thank you guys so much. Uh, monthly cost of 15,000 per month on this loan. So, the issue is, is in order for me to be able to get the maximum out of this, I'm gonna have to severely uh, deficit what our spending is, what our actual budget is. So I'm going to try to do that now by going to down to 50% for as much of it as I can. Now I think our electricity, we can't afford to do that because we're already way lower than our production level is supposed is should be for the city. We're going to have power issues. That's absolutely going to happen. I'm trying to cut that off before it does get to that point. Um, but Maxi Bloke, it's a Delta Raid, Hunter six four uh, Hunt 6409, Culinary Zest, Krusty Butte. Thank you guys so much for showing up. Hun uh, Delta um, Delta 124 was j I cannot talk today. I need to slow down. Delta 1246 was just playing Elite Dangerous, doing a phenomenal uh, tutorial on that and helping people out in learning. Um, one of these days, I hope to get it on PlayStation, or I mean on PC, and move my account over from PlayStation so that I can join that crew. But as of right now, I'm enjoying Elite Dangerous Horizons on PlayStation 5 with the updated frame rate, the better, beefier hardware versus PlayStation 4. Today, however, we're focusing on this. So right now, the service fee for electricity is only 76%. We're going to raise that to 100%, meaning that their bills are 100%. We're not giving any of the... Uh, people, oh no, actually, that has to be the server. Oh, you know what? This is the demand, right? This is supply and demand. I can hear people popping in and out, but I can't check while I'm on stream. So I'm going to see what happens if we drop, well, everything but the water and that, and the uh, sewage. I'm not doing that. Can we get a, wow, water is very expensive. Let's drop that down. Actually, we'll leave the service fee back to where it was. Was that 74%? 74%? Let's go here. So, and I know this is kind of boring stuff right here, guys. I apologize. It is what it is. I'm learning the game. I'm learning how the different budgets are, uh, the, the just the different uh, municipal uh, granularity that was added into the game. Um, wow, why? That's a gigantic budget for Parks and Rec. Let's drop everything down. I just want to see what happens if we do this now. Let's try that. I really would not like to take another loan out if I can absolutely help it. Let me catch back up in chat here. Shivel, uh, Ray, Shivel says, a raid, that is awesome. Uh, there's Delta Creator 246, welcome. Z Spock Z, welcome. A Raging Furball, I heard they added modular building upgrades. Is, is it that true? It, it absolutely is true. And I would love to show you that as soon as I have, the, oh no, now we're having water issues, sewage issues. Okay, so we can't do that. Well, that was pretty quick response. Subject my can of steady. Yeah, kidding, right? <laughs> Everything's down. Everything's Hello. downhill now. Let's uh, let's bring this up to. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Max and All right, let's try Good this. Morning from New Zealand. Hey, there's uh, Good evening Kiwi. from Ireland. <laughs> Kiwi. Let's go to eighty percent. See if we can get away with eighty percent on this. How are you guys doing today? 
We're doing yeah. good, man. How's the city going? It is. Have we, have we sunk it yet? <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> have we made it at last? Give it some time. <laughs> Give it some time. <laughs> <laughs> i'm working on it all right it's, these things don't just happen look i'm not nero okay <laughs> i'm not nero okay i can't just uh i can't just magically sit there i have to From look like nero i'm trying to, to do something <laughs> to look like i'm actually trying to do something so actually to answer your question <laughs> raging for a ball yes it is absolutely correct say for example if I had enough money to put this, uh, or actually, I don't even have to do that. I can go show you one of the buildings we already have in. Let me move the microphone just a tiny bit there. All right, I'm still getting used to the keyboard controls. It hurts to play with them. I prefer the, the controller still, for the, especially for the camera control. Yeah. But I did, it looks like, get some improvement on this. Um, the vehicles don't look nearly as bad as they get. Oh, look at that one. Nice, col nice colors there, buddy. Who are you? Get well, dude, Boom. you got the daughter. Oh no. Yeah, I was saving for Delta Dota. Wait. The new free update coming soon to CS2. Yes, SK99, they are adding. What is this truck doing? Wow, that is a delivery. This guy, this, give this guy a raise. He did, didn't, even, didn't even care about that light post. Just took it straight out to deliver that wood. Anyway, let's pull back out here. Um, got wood. Got now wood. Do. <laughs> I'm listening, but it works. So I Don't won't be so wood. active, says Shivel. Um, so, looking at... Oh, here you go. This is a perfect example. So, here is the high school. The Shock and Awe Deluxe High School. And the Shock and Awe Deluxe High School has two additional wings. The initial building, Raging Furball, only comes with this center portion. It does not have the additional wings on each of the sides, nor does it come with the actual sports field. I jumped the gun, which I probably shouldn't have. This is probably where I all went wrong in this city to begin with. Because I unlocked all of those unlocks right away instead of doing it gradually. The other thing that's very different from City Skylines 1 is this. Is the, dens is the, the way that the zoning is actually broken up. So low density uh, residential demands. These are obviously the, the larger houses that are usually have yards, right? Medium density is usually going to be apartments or, in that respect, uh, some kind of condos. High density are absolutely going to be condos. The commercial demand or the ones between these two that have commercial, like the first floor is usually like shops or cafes or something along those lines. And then the all of the residents live above them. Um, that's in between these two. Now, these really haven't changed that much, but um, the way that the additional residential zoning is broken up really does make a difference and it's something that's going to have to be planned for um accordingly that's I, i'm willing to bet everything that's exactly why they put the welfare office in as well because that is obviously a thing now too because of the way the disparity is and like even in the city i had to raise the the taxes to 20 percent, which this would probably be closer to about 13 percent in city skylines one if I had to kind of estimate the dif the differences between how the economic model in this game compares to its prior game. Um, and so, yeah, they're going to say that the taxes are a little bit higher than they should be, right? They're going to complain about it. But the one complaint they have there, if you count obviously going out, that's why we're looking at a happy rating. Because we have more green and the higher value all combined is still higher than the, what, 9 that we have, or negative 9 overall. So that's the only reason why we have the happiness value we have. And I'm hoping that that can translate into more city growth and or what is this? Waiting for an ambulance. Uh, waiting, uh, translate to city growth and more importantly, try to dig us out of the hole that I put us in. I ain't going to lie. I did it myself. 100%. Let me catch up on the on the uh, chat here. Um, a little late. I'm sorry to hear the Delta daughter is not doing well. I hope she feels better, better very soon. Both goes out to Delta 1246, Delta Wife, and Delta Creator. Because uh, grandparents need that attention and, and uh, recognition too. Shout out to grandparents. SK99 says, Sin, did you see the new free update coming soon to CS2? Yes. Give me just a moment. If I go here and I disable this for just a second. And over here... They did indeed add a... I'm not going to play the video, right? Because I'm not sure if it's copyright stricken. I'm not, I don't want to get copyright stricken. But 
On here, they did include that they are covering eight regions more with, um, with more than 2,500 additional assets and presenting the free region packs, which is part, and it, I, I'm very happy that they gave the modders actual credit. They gave the modder, they actually named them, called them out. I love that. That's good stuff. So those are coming to Paradox Ooh. Mods, but Paradox Mods aren't in the game yet. Paradox mods are not in the game. Not yet, at least. So it's only a matter of time when we get them, I guess. I, do you know what I mean? All I can do is say I'm not entirely sure. I don't know for certain. The other thing is we did buy two additional tiles out in this area. And we did buy a cargo train terminal, which I've seen now three or four trains just pass by. So that leads me to believe that either I screwed up something. These tracks look good, though. And I have to give mad credit, by the way. The networking is so much easier. If you guys saw this, and yes, I have a problem with trains. Uh, I don't know trains very well. I'm learning trains. But this game allowed me to put this this train track in without any, any issues, any problem whatsoever. And I can't recommend that enough for other people. Uh, that that would be something you want to consider, too. We probably don't need double going out, though, now that I think about that. Oh, it's oh, it's all one block. Oh. Well, no, I have to. I guess I do have to have double because there's two tracks there. We'll keep it. We'll keep it and see. Uh, let's see. Catch up on chat. Yeah, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. <laughs> oh, she had a couple of vaccine shots this morning. Oh, that's absolutely going to happen. Or so my wife tells I'm gonna go mute for a bit. Okay, Krusty, thank you. Yeah, those shots are never fun, especially for little ones, man. Oh. Look, I'm gonna tell you, uh, and I'm not. I'm gonna try to be very, very polite about this, as, as polite as I possibly can. But as a man who had to take one of uh, both of his sons to go get them uh, circumcised, that was not fun. That is, that is torturous. That wasn't just torturous for them. That was torturous for me as a parent because they're looking at me like, why, dad, why? And all I can do is go, hey, it's okay. Calm down. Don't worry about that. It's just a scalpel. <laughs> How is this okay, daddy? <laughs> Granted, they're very, very young, but I mean, it's just the, like the look of disappointment. The look of disappointment in their eyes. Like, why? Why would you do this to me? You're supposed to be on my side, Daddy. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. What if, why would you do this, Dad? I thought we were cool. You made me read about it in a book. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess you guys weren't expecting that in, in today's stream, were you? Uh huh. Why, Daddy? Because everyone else is doing it. <laughs> All right, I'm going to try to extend this road and bring this and wrap it around the train terminal. Because I'm wondering if we just need to gather or ga uh, gain more uh, industrial, which we do have a little bit of demand down here at the bottom. Uh, zoom out. Because I might be able to put a forestry, put forestry in here. That would actually be pretty cool, I think. I'm hoping. Whoa! Holy zoom, Batman. That's what I was thinking. Put a, put a forestry area in right next to the cargo thing. You might get a few more trains. All right, let's do that, and then go from the big roads to the small roads. My my question is, like, what did that person in, in that residential house, like, what did they need four full tree trunks for? <laughs> what are they building? A whole truck, that, yeah. That right. truck just pulled up and just dropped the logs right off the front door. Or, <laughs> no like, kidding, just dropped building? it right off, like, boom. I'm like... <laughs> Okay. The other thing now, now, and I know it's early. Please understand that I'm not here to to rip up um, City Skylines uh, two by any measure. No. But I will say oh, that because no, no. it's still early days, right? But the lack of like, I, I did a I, I did a recording just to test out because I was still fussing with the the settings, right? Trying to get the best possible look overall. And here you go. This is a perfect example. So I was zooming in on a cop car. As he was going around doing his 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 daily uh, uh, duty, and I didn't noticed a couple of things. First and foremost, 
they actually use their uh, their brake lights. They use their backup lights. They use their their signals, right? Not just the police, I'm sure, but all other, I'm sure other cars do too. But <laughs> let's just watch. <laughs> when they have to like go to a call or something like that, I have yet to see the actual lights come on. Even though I'm already getting like chirper messages saying that there's crime, rapid crime. It's called Crook City or Crook County. What did you think was going to happen? Moving in. Come on now. But they just drive through the assets. Whereas in Sims, in, in City Skylines 1, the cops would actually get out of the car and go into the house. And sometimes you'd have a whole other person come out with them because they're getting arrested, right? That doesn't happen. Mm. In here, if you follow a, a fire truck, for example, too, the fire truck will stop in front of a building that's on fire, and then in two minutes or so, woof, the fire is magically put out like they did it with telepathy. Oh, oh no, there's no like little graphic of them like yeah, spraying yet. water and not yet. Like that. nothing like it that. It might be something that they're gonna add in. Yeah, yeah. It might be something that they're you know they wanted to just get the game out and like take take feedback then of okay what do we need to fix and then they'll you know with a big patch then they'll just sort of fix it all right and i mean, I mean it doesn't be a good thing for that uh, delta's asking about his giant dump nobody wants to see an animation of that well, let me go uh let's go look at your giant dump there delta i never thought i'd say that i'm <laughs> that's one thing i never thought i'd say uh it let's looks see uh let's see here uh name. look in the mirror delta. um is that fiber? I'm sure it That's a uh, fiber. That what is that? I thought you weren't supposed to go to Chipotle anymore, dude. Oh wow. Oh, what are you storing rum in your in your dump? What are, what's going on here? <laughs> you're a moonshiner, aren't you? <laughs> I you're That's a moonshiner. A, a night of him drinking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah this is the other night. <laughs> the other night in <laughs> Preparing a red box. <laughs> he, he said, I had Taco Bell and too much to drink. Help! Oh, no. Box of Delta's dumpy dump. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see. Let me catch up on this. Um, Stephen Eddington. Hey, Stephen Eddington. He said, stuck at work. We'll make it home until probably after the stream is over. I don't know. It depends on how long. I mean, I'm, I'm today is Friday. I'm going to try to go for a little longer. We're not going to do a uh, Flashpoint stream today. Because Flashpoint is a turn-based game, I think all of the future content for Flashpoint is most likely just going to be um, pre-recorded episodes. I, I've got a storyline that I'm going to work with and just continue to build it up from there. If I can get uh, people to help me out with voice work, that would be cool, but it's not necessary at all. I can just do it from my logs or whatever, right, type of thing. So I'm planning on doing, like, focused on those. This, These will probably be streams for a little bit longer, just simply because I like hanging out with you guys. I love being able to do this and build with you and name the, the assets after everybody. It's a lot more fun doing this with friends. We love being here too, buddy. Than trying to do it by yeah. myself, you're, right? You're yeah. in need of some voiced actors, you say? Potentially, yes. <laughs> well, I mean, that was the... I have been known to dabble. Well, you're not a female. <laughs> And ironically, like my Star Traders Frontier series, the main character is a female. In Cybernize Flashpoint, my main character is a female. It was weird that that just worked out. But in order to get like the voiceovers, I'm don't, I didn't want to use an AI. I didn't want to use an AI, right? I was just trying to be, you know, real about it. I wasn't going to try to go out of my way and use an AI and potentially uh, set off a firestorm in that regard. Uh, let's get some commercial in here. Well, let me help you. Let me help you out real quick there, Sin. Krusty, would you be interested in doing a voice acting job? <laughs> oh no, you don't. I why can't. are you? Why are you volunteering somebody? <laughs> that's not. That's not the how the <laughs> Democrat. <laughs> Played the tar of the last Sim City that everyone hated. Oh, 20, I, Sim I, City I, 2013 I, says Raging Furball. I actually. I played the hell out of SimCity 4, and I still own SimCity 4. I did not get SimCity 2013 because of the giant uh, dumpster fire that was. Um, CS1 was a huge jump in difficulty. It, well, CS1 was actually not that difficult as far as city management was concerned, but network management was sure would surely kick in the nuts and drag it down in the middle of the street. 
Uh, drop off sounds you're done doing. Do, 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 just making sure I'm catching up. Even in SimCity, you'd see the cops get into gunfights with criminals, and firefighters would get out and fight the fire. In SimCity and uh, City Skylines One, the the, uh, the firefighters do that too. I haven't yet to see the cops get into a fire uh, firefight, um, but those things do happen. Uh, That's because you haven't built a maxi block heights yet. Not yet, right? It's Every all guy. firefights. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was the whole point of the road. <laughs> <laughs> Read after me, Krusty. I'll check my calendar. You'll be hearing from my agent. The okay. other thing too is that when I experienced uh, like these, I'll all these new experiences, calendar. you'll be hearing from my agent. That's right. See, she already knows. That was great. That was, that was... Now, can you say it like you're sad uh -huh. and you didn't get the job? No. <laughs> I'm positive. <laughs> See, I love that. That no, fire wait, that you no, have, I... that's the kind of fire we need. You're hired. <laughs> Don't tell anybody. Don't let anybody tell you no. The whole world wants Nobody to puts Krusty in a corner. That's important. <laughs> Nobody puts Krusty in a corner. No, he thinks he's Patrick Swayze. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, lads, if he starts ripping people's throats out, I'm out of here. <laughs> Roadhouse! Sims Roadhouse! How about Sim? Oh, man. Uh, let's go here and grab one of these. No. Dead wrong. And did somebody also did actually, bring up... They? Somebody else also brought up that um, I have a uh, grid issue. And I do have a grid issue. However, in the next areas that we uh, grow into, like say over here, not close enough to this obviously, but out in further areas, wherever else we grow out to, there will be a community or at least one community that will have more curvy lines and but whatever I can do is, I mean, the closest I can get to a cul-de-sac is gonna be a roundabout, a small roundabout, so I, because they don't actually have cul-de-sacs in here, but this will be as close as I can possibly get to it. Um, so I will do that in the future as well. This was more, like I said, just to try to get a good feel for how the uh, mechanics work, how the new uh, city management stuff is, because City Skylines 1 did not have that much city management. It had more network management. And I love I, all these... I can see exactly where all those curvy lines are going to be. Right next to Sin's sleazy roadhouse and strip bar. <laughs> Dude, I didn't even have the marketing campaign ready. What are you doing? <laughs> That's it. Yeah, we're building it. <laughs> we gotta build it now. now. I have to, yeah. You're right. Delta. <laughs> Said so you dung it now. <laughs> Stop murdering so many trees. I'm not murdering trees. No, 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 no. Hold on. I am not murdering trees. The reason why we're here now is... Because uh, it's going to be fall soon and winter, and I have yet to experience that. You guys are going to be hopefully oh, joining us right for it. Here. Yeah, I haven't done any. I've killed any of these trees. They were green when we started this entire series. Yeah, Vontae, I know exactly what you mean. I know the exactly. Trees are voluntarily yes, he was up murdering your life. trees inadvertently. No, Every but time about... you put down a road sin, it, it, in about, it uh, flattens the tree. In about 27 minutes, I will. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> Get her done. Either, either sin has got a chainsaw or um, Crazy Frog just entered. <laughs> oh, wow. I haven't heard Crazy Frog in so long. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's it's a song that will live this. on forever. Right? It will. It absolutely yeah. will. Yeah. No matter how hard we try to get rid of it. <laughs> Okay, we could do this. So this one wants to use yeah, every... like the where's the boundary? Oh, now it won't show me. Oh, the boundary's right up against it. Okay, so so if you notice, then when you drop a road, it takes out the trees. But then whenever you delete the road, the trees they come back, but they're in sapling state. Oh, I didn't notice that. Yeah, that's oh, what Dave wow. Andy's talking about. You're killing a bunch of trees. Gotcha. Well, I mean, there's this map had plenty of trees. Thank you, Diavante. I didn't know that. <laughs> but this one's a sapling right here, yeah. So you can tell it's a sapling because of the blue dotted uh, circumference. Just like me. 
Wait. What? Damn it, that didn't work. Uh, yeah. Begrudgingly. You're awful bad. Not, but not in a good way, I take it? Is that what you're telling me? Awful bad, but not in a good way. Alright, so... Let's try these new industries. I'm gonna put awful bad in, in, in the same uh, bag as uh, crazy insane. In the city's fresh insane in the membrane. Uh, 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 well, you know, why situation. are you crazy insane? <laughs> it's one or the other. <laughs> Pick one. A driving advisory has been Cannot be both. Please exercise caution if you must. Kind of a redundant saying, you know what I'm saying? What I mean? This has been a local public service announcement. This is Yeah, but sometimes like just crazy or just insane doesn't quite cut it. <laughs> yeah, but then again, it just works doesn't cut it either. Oh man, this is horrible. Come on. There and then there and okay, I guess that is. I guess that's weird. They uh, that's one thing. Okay, there's a nitpick for you. In that menu, you can't really tell what you're highlighting and what you're not highlighting. That's uh, that's not very fun. Don't read it, Sin. Wait. Don't read what? Don't be doing that to me, man. Yeah, we know that though. It's definitely crazy and insane. All right, so. Go here. With my shrink agreed. <laughs> All three of them. So soft ends. That's wait. That's a weird name for a forestry company. I don't like that. I don't like that. <laughs> it was okay until you made an icky man. <laughs> <Until> I, <laughs> it was probably okay until I brought attention to it. Now it's fitting. There we go. Oh god, no, it's fitting. Oh god. <laughs> Licking windows on the short bus is the fun pastime. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh man. Somebody's got to do it. If oh, you know what? No, no, no. They're supposed to be licked. Somebody with a wrench, get that one. Come on. <laughs> you really got to you, you really got to quote that one. <laughs> No, I think it's time for Delta to do his job. I know. This it's is about true. Time to do <laughs> there we go. To the living Delta boys, Speaking Delta of which, that's a really good himself. point. Yeah. That is a very time good point. Time to get point. to work, Golden God. <laughs> We've got a bunch of people here. <laughs> All right. By taking children to get stabbed by steely thing. <laughs> da, da, da. Remember, everyone. Don't forget to smash that like button. And if you're not already subscribed to Sin's Arcade, what's wrong with you? I know, hey. right? <laughs> I've been liking the lick button all day. <laughs> Kiwi. I've Dude, heard that one so liking the like button. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Kiwi. I didn't... You gotta buy me dinner first, dude. <laughs> Or at least give him a chloroform cloth. That's right. That's right. I, I have I have standards, damn it. <laughs> That's why I'm going with the chloroform. Does this does this rag smell like chloroform to you? <laughs> oh no. Oh yeah, that's right. Sorry, sorry, Delta. I'll I'll get it. And we didn't have a new moderator, so congratulations to our new moderator. Moderator. Oh seven. <laughs> Which one am I getting? Who, who's the latest victim? <clears throat> You'll see. Okay. She knows. I mean moderator. <laughs> see, because she does such a great job moderating for other people, and she's phenomenal with the snipe, the the quote snipe. So the uh, the quote snipe queen herself uh... has now become a moderator. For Sins Arcade as well. And, Welcome. Okay. Uh, there you go. Yeah. I can do that too. Hey. All right. You ask and you <laughs> shall receive, Diavante. Hey. So, for for anyone in in Sins chat that doesn't know Krusty, we're so sorry, but you will have fun. <laughs> <laughs> as long as you're uh, sure. as long as you're not I braiding, I think you're going to be okay. <laughs> 
Just saying. As long as you're not Brayden, you're probably going to be all right. I was, I was pleasant. Mm -hmm. You were. Yeah. Yes, you were pleasant at one point. Clink, clink. All right, let's take a look at now. At one point. So we did get the budget considerably down to 96000 We're still in def deficit of 96000 a month, but 15 of that is going to the loan interest, right? I like how it breaks down here. Service upkeeps? Holy crap, dude. That is crazy. Can I drop this a little further? Hmm. I didn't know it was going to be nearly as intricate, potentially, as uh, City Skylines 1. Because usually in the early game, you could probably stick around like 50% and in gradually increase it. I should have thought about this here, too, as well. But, I mean, that's how you learn, right? Oh, why don't you just do what America does and just cut the education fund? Because if I really wanted to make this as close to realistic, then the budget would be next to nothing. I'd be pocketing almost everything. Um, and, uh, yeah, we'd be getting low. We'd be just printing our own money and pretending like it doesn't exist. Hey, Boomtown! Yeah, but that exactly. isn't that how capitalism works? I mean, yeah, <laughs> in, a, in essence, yes. Especially if you ask the, <laughs> the, the Federal Trade Bureau. And isn't this, isn't this a, you know, capitalist type city? No. Or are we going it's communism just finally? It's just, just crooks. <laughs> It doesn't mean that we have to be it's capitalists. Not it's I mean, I'm not saying we're communists either. We're, we're not really socialists. Socialism, yeah. We're anarchists. I agree with that. We're just I'm a really, socialist. really well-behaved anarchists. We have morals. That's really well -behaved we're behaved anarchists. We have, we have morals. Okay. How does that work, sir? Yeah, very carefully. It's a, it's a very, it's a, it's a very fine line. It's not easy to maintain. Dave Pompey says, "No, I can't moderate. I have a trigger ban hammer." <laughs> Oh. <laughs> okay. I, if the triumvirate know, finds that like you have, boot? yeah. If if the triumvirate uh, votes that you uh, unnecessarily banned, um, we will have a discussion. And then if that's the case, then you probably would get banned as to you know banned in turn. Hammurabi's law and all, but um, but I don't foresee that happening, Diavante. You're a good guy. Oh seven, we got your back. You got our back. We got your back. Somebody's scratching somebody's back. But I got an itch right there in between my shoulder blades. Thanks. I appreciate it. Coolness. Let's go. <laughs> Scratch flower. Yeah. We got. We all got each other's back. Someone scratches there, please. <laughs> Advanced pollution management. Okay. Is that over here? In here? Oh, go back into that. Oh, that's right. You got it there. Uh, waste. Is that just a policy or something? Wait, I think that's a policy. <laughs> Skid Row. Da -da -da -da. Ooh, okay, Can't let's do that. Roadside parking. And everybody's, you now everybody's going to charge 50. Period. You want to park on the side of the road? You're going to have to pay for it. Christy Butte. Let's go in there. Roadside parking, recycling. Energy consumption awareness, and hike that price right up. Because it takes a team of moderators to to keep an eye on you, SK ninety nine. Damn. Your reputation Pre precedes you. Precedes you. <laughs> yep, absolutely does. It absolutely does. I'm battling the voices in my head, trying to find that one I missed. <laughs> I don't think you what missed. Did you, did you miss, miss anything? Oh. I don't think you missed anything. I missed one because I didn't have a wrench. Oh, and everybody oh. else skipped it. Why is everyone a mod? <laughs> because then everybody has to be uh, accountable. That's why. Welcome to being a moderator, SK99. <laughs> I don't care. It's all good. Just, just throwing wrenches like a monkey, aren't you? That's right. If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge uh, uh, crippling depression. Wait, no. Okay. Yeah, if you can you dodge a wrench, a you can dodge wrenches, moral responsibility. Careful. Yeah, that works. <laughs> uh, let's go here. Um... Boop. Boop. Glad I'm not that. 
mod? Is that what you were gonna say? This <laughs> K99 <laughs> with yeah. your rent? Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what did you Wait, say? What? My name's Blue. <laughs> <laughs> He's just glad I'm not. What that. is this <laughs> sorcery? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what is this sorcery? <laughs> Welcome to the dark side. <laughs> that was actually pretty good. <laughs> good. I can feel your anger growing. I, and I can feel your laryngitis is starting. <laughs> wow, no, look man. at this crap, man. That is not a street road at all. <laughs> that is horse poop. All right, well. Something's telling me this. There's something wrong with that um, cargo station. All right, like, give me a second. I'll take a look at it. Why you not get any trains? Well, let's keep an eye on that. I didn't. I just want to pay attention to one asset waiting for trains to come in. Because that would be kind of boring. All right, there's a train right there. Are you going to come in? No. Where are you going? Is en route from Gilling to Cloutier. <laughs> Could you imagine oh, living in a place called Cloutier? <clears throat> okay, then I'm gonna slow you right down because I've just Is that uh, the, the streams a bit behind on YouTube, but I've just yeah. watched you put down a road. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I saw what you did. You overlapped it at the bottom and then you like squared it up at the top. And what you did ultimately was ended up with a screwed up road. It's all wonky. <laughs> Affirmative. Well, this square that I made up here over here isn't actually as squared up as I hoped it would be, too. It is what it is. At this point, I'm not even sure I should be too concerned over it. Let's try it this way. Oh, man. That, that, that is just so triggering. 87, yeah, I'm just 88, thinking, just 89, be min, 90. Min max and... But look at that. When you look at that, that does not look like a 90-degree road. And I guess maybe I'm looking at the side, you know, the, the outer perimeter. Don't trust your eye, bro. <laughs> trust, trust the numbers. Okay, got it. 90 degrees. 90 degrees. And go over here. Make sure that's out. And up. 90 degrees. And that way. Streams behind, yeah. This is like the first time I've turned Maxi down so that I can find <laughs> Oh, don't worry, Christy. It's not the first time it's been turned down. Yeah. <laughs> Put them bumps. Wow, that was a good one, Kiwi. That was great. Yeah. Why are you always breaking my heart, Kiwi? <laughs> oh, that was golden. That was... <laughs> Boom. Oh, you swain. You even put in, like, drums? Thanks, Sin. <laughs> love you, man. I love you. It's all good. Yeah, I feel it. I, feel I know, it. I know. I know. You can feel it. Do you feel? Can you feel it, Mr. Krabs? Can you feel it? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Where the hell is the? Give me the opportunity. I will take it. He showed me his crabby you know, party. <laughs> oh. Um, do 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 oh, here. Lord. Oh, okay. I just. I can God, just I hope Christy shows me turned down. <laughs> I can still hear Did you. you. <laughs> Do the industrial areas still work the same in this sin? That's what like I'm trying to find out. By offices? Um, that's what I'm trying to find out here. Um, so, for example, I'm I'm expanding. Now, I normally don't like to segment up or segregate um, the segregate like the different uh, industry or I mean uh, the different uh, uh, zoning types. But because pollution is a gigantic and sort of way more in this game than it, than it was in City Skylines 1, that's the only reason I have them separated out because the wind is... Even though the uh, <laughs> the the snow, if that's what that's supposed to be, or rain, I'm not sure. So it's rain, but it's very cold rain. Okay. Um, mm. So I know that that's not what it shows the wind is going. So if I were to put down... For example, this, notice the wind is all actually going northbound from the way the camera's perspective currently is, headed towards the top of the screen. 
So because of that, all of these, all of the industry is back up this way so that we can get the most out of it. Oh no, we are dramatically doing bad on this. Let's uh, go in there. So I'm glad I actually went in the there. Areas, because we are If you surround the areas with um, offices, does it, does it contain the um, pollution the way that it did in City Skylines 1? No. No, it does not. It does not. Not, to, not that I have seen thus far. Um, that being said, and you said the, the wind uh, affects it. Yeah, the the wind will push the the the, the pollution. So if I had, if I had the industries Ooh, back in this area and I had all the residences up here, they would be just getting sick like crazy because it'd just be pushing polluted air right into their into their airspace. Okay. So that is something to to. That's an do. interesting mechanic. Yeah, yeah, that's interesting, man. Get ooh, ooh, <laughs> like I'm just thinking on like a map that has mountains that's gonna like bend the wind and stuff like that. That's gonna be real interesting. It's gonna have to be something that people are gonna have to con are gonna have to strongly consider. That's for sure. Yeah, it it seems like this game is more one that. You really have to slow down, consider everything before you even place a single thing. Actually, yeah, so, I haven't. Okay. <laughs> I haven't done a formal um, differences between the two because it's not fair to look at City Skylines One with everything that's been added, and compare it to yeah, City yeah. Skylines Two in its launch state. Right. Um, being that being yeah, said, absolutely. I'm going uh, when I do the com the comparison video, it'll be based off of the the. Uh, development portions, right? The stuff that's now added into City Skylines 2 and that you have to be cognizant of and pay attention to because, for example, like right now, we're we're still... We got some money, but, I mean, we're down to, thankfully, negative th uh, 3,000 a week from the, what, 200,000 it was or something like that? So we're gaining yeah. <laughs> a little bit back, uh, but I had to adjust the budget accordingly. And because I adjusted the budget, everything else was starting to fall. Now, I just added that coal power plant as much as I didn't want to, um, but how does that actually adjust our power? Needs must when the devil drives. Wow. Yeah. We don't have a battery uh, Krusty, plant. you misquoted. You'll have to edit that. You what now? You'll have to edit that quote. Why? Uh, you missed uh, You need to part. make shipping lines for trains. And you need oh I they actually have to go out like I have to send them out is that what you're what saying parts? hold on let's take a look that's at what parts. I was thinking Nathan. that's what I was saying there's something wrong with that cargo station well okay in order for me to put that cargo freight station in I had to put a rail yard in first thankfully I put the rail yard in and then we had and I deleted it because at the time I didn't have any additional space so now fuck how that thing is gigantic <laughs> That thing is massive. That's what she said. I know, right? <laughs> That's exactly what she said. How did you... Did yeah, you, but did then you, you turned the light on. You... <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. She's like, wait. Oh, that was the magnification mode. Oh. You're back up all the way. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> Got him! <laughs> oh, really? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yep, so that's that's exactly why we didn't get anything coming in. Alright, so there's that. Oh, God. And I think I'm going to have to take it all the way out. Thank you, by the way. Whoever was at SK99? Yeah. SK99, thank you for letting me know about that. Did it, did it take? I don't... Did People you, ask um, me why I drink, because I go online and talk to you guys. <laughs> <laughs> um, did you get that error, Chrissy? No, what part did I miss? Uh, that's a weird for a forestry company. Must be a weird name for a forestry Dang company. Dang it! I actually kind of like the fact that they do this then, because then you can choose the routes that come in. So I actually do like that. It is much different. I love and the way that Sin just continues to ignore the conversation that's going on in the background. He's a professional. He's not like those other guys. Oh. 
It's not. Ign it's not. It's not it's ignoring. I'm not ignoring. I can. It's just not. Yeah, he's ignorant. Just being a pro. You're not ignoring anyone. <clears throat> it's just not. A, it's not important enough for me to to dip in and and readjust anything. I don't feel. Maybe I could be wrong. I trust them. I we trust that they can handle it. Then. <laughs> I, I trust that you guys can handle it. There's no reason for me to... No vehicles. But we love girl. Create the depot. Ah, <laughs> uh, all right. So, uh, all right. Uh, you gotta go bye bye now. <laughs> all that work just to get straight lines, just to take it all off. This <laughs> all of that work just to get those straight lines in. Yeah, your roads are still crooked, dude. I know. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Appreciate it. Good job. <laughs> you can Just do to it. make a part of the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the hell? Are you having I love fun the way, yet? <laughs> I, love, I love the way that uh, you can delete a road while a car is on it and it disappears. <laughs> yeah, it just disappears. All right. Uh, yeah. Imagine if that was in real life. Yeah. Oh, that's how you rotate it. Okay. How do yeah, you know which way is the movie, front? Or they would probably make a movie about that. So it's like people the driving front? through the woods. Next thing, the road disappears, and they're like, "What the hell? <laughs> how did we get out of here?" I hope Car that's the front. God, look how oh, many trees he just killed. Oh man, that's horrible. Be so that looks so ugly. <laughs> God. I'd do it sideways, dude. He's just sneezing to it. <clears throat> hold on, hold on, hold on. It's paused, yeah, so wait, we don't have to worry about it. Well, I still reckon sideways. Here's the thing: if I if I rotate it and bring it ninety out. degrees into this kiwi. There's no space. Even without the road there, there's no space for it to go in. These lines themselves have to plug in so that they can provide train, and then the train would have to go into the cargo train terminal and then head back out either to this area or back out well, the there. Only... Right? I, I the only thing that seems to be restricting your... Get rid of the cargo place and, and just sideways that train um, and the train. The only thing that seems to be restricted so far is that rule. It, it won't matter which way he's in and out. I would need both, that. though, for the cargo freight is the point that I'm trying to make. If you notice here, so there's the cargo. Um, yeah, here's the train terminal. And now it shows that there's an actual route, which it didn't have before. Cargo route one, cargo route two. Um, and it shows that they that there actually have some vehicles exporting. So the cargo train terminal, we, it just needs trains now, which is why we have to have the rail yard too. So yeah, the only thing, or thing that seems to be restricting your movement was that at the minute is that road that, that's up behind it that this you know one? goes yeah. left to right, turns yeah. ninety degree. Like delete that. Well, completely. I can't delete just, all of it because the as it is. I can't delete all of it because the the forestry building is over here. Teeny tiny little oh, building. Uh, can you yeah. reroute the road in from a different angle so that it, it just gives you a bit more space to, to maneuver things with the you know the depots and that? Yeah, so I can you're get not rid having of these. to, you know. Yeah, I don't want to get rid of that. Okay, so I can get it, rid of those. Um, if I have to, I mean, I'll get rid of this since I don't think it's really built anything just yet either. You're saying get rid of this road too? Along Skid Row? Uh, what is that? Yeah. Uh, I don't even see the name of the. Listen, road. it's Kid Row. Things die. Oh, come on. <laughs> Keyboard, work with me here. Yeah, Hawthorne Street. All right, so we're getting rid of Hawthorne Street. Give me a, a finger wiggle. Here. Yeah, you could just put the entrance to that um, forestry section down in the top right hand portion of the industry, and that'll, that'll free up that entire right hand side for you then to kind of maneuver things around in a way that works better for you. Because it's all very close and requiring tight turns as it as currently is sitting. Well, see, so here's the thing. I wasn't. Uh, this probably wouldn't be where I would want to have this anyway. I would most likely. I would mm. rather. Yeah, I can't have it over there because it's all Can industry or residential. 
I would actually rather have it back over this way so that the trains can come down and around and go out to whatever they have to do in that regard. Unfortunately, because there's a hill here, the only other thing that I could do, and I now that I know that there's a cost for, oh, that's not it, it's landscaping. Not that one, landscaping. Now I know I do know that there's a cost for the landscaping too, I believe. Um, mm -hmm. Let's check it, let's check it. So we have 1500. Oh, what the <laughs> <laughs> what did you oh, do? I'll no. wait for the stream to catch up. <laughs> oh no! No, stop it! Oh, why is it doing that? Level terrain? Yeah, to this height. He let the water in. And he oh, let the water in. I'm guessing. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. You know what? Everything goes. We're taking all he this out. He built himself out. a... What do you call that mountain? I don't think from, it's costing uh, us anything. Those encounters? Oh, uh... The devil something. Yeah, devil's tabletop or something like that. Yeah. Oh, something yeah. Something like that. Yeah. It's a mesa. Yeah. I, I, I always refer to it as uh, the mashed potato hill. It's like a crusty butte, actually. Love to go it's it's, yeah. it's kind of ironic that you would say that. Down. That was K99 technically... says terraforming and landscaping is free. <laughs> oh, let the water in, sin. <laughs> Let it flow! <laughs> and just like that, we created Atlantis. <laughs> <laughs> and Frozen 3. <laughs> it was about that time I realized <laughs> this guy was crazy! <laughs> Insanely crazy. Oh, that ain't. Oh, I don't own that <laughs> tile! Oh, Okay, we're, 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 oh no, we're reloading. <laughs> your your citizens are so glad. <laughs> save it before oh, you do it. No. No. Please what? save it before you do it. <laughs> oh, Alright, load that game. So what's this going to be? <laughs> Kiwi Lake? <laughs> mm, I don't know. Hey, actually, I'm going to take a really quick break, guys. Uh, be right back. Go back in here and see oh, what we God, have to do. Oh, God, I'm right, sure good. we can amuse ourselves. <laughs> he showed me his Krabby Patty. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Krusty. Well done. In fact, while you guys are doing that, I'm going to take the break, but I'm going to give everybody through. points. Yeah. Oh, well uh, done, Krusty. You read back in chats, and she's already yeah. quoted you, buddy. <laughs> oh, I bet. I bet. And it's all right. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't scared. <laughs> Science scared. I scared. <laughs> I need to repair it. <laughs> Delta, do you know how to repair it? <laughs> Everybody gets sixty nine thousand tokens, <laughs> and I will be right back. Thank you guys for your patience. I love and I appreciate all of you. Thank you for being here. Hey, thank you, time, <laughs> In the words of Trusty, you're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> That's gonna be stuck in my, oh my fucking head all night, no. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> you. I hope it is. <laughs> you guys are moron. I'm Number so glad I know you. <laughs> A name, name added after weird. I didn't say weird today. <laughs> if you work in a security, sorry, <clears throat> sorry, let me that again. If you work as a security guard in a Samsung store, no, is that no, no, do it in the other of the galaxy. <laughs> In the other voice, go on, it's much more fun. <laughs> what voice? The Peter Griffin watch? <laughs> Jewish. I'm thinking. These are my <laughs> thinking grenades. <laughs> <laughs> so, so if you pull the pin on the thinking grenades, do you actually have an idea? Well, you won't know and use it. <laughs> I 
Bueno, venga, <risa> Now you gotta come up with an idea. Ah. Where's your lucky charms now, sunshine? They're always Boy, after me, lucky good. charms. Not Scottish. <laughs> don't care. If it's not Scottish, it's crap! What a load nope. of crap! What a load of crap! Can anyone speak Glaswegian? Yeah. Flashman. My Glaswegian friend. <laughs> oh, you know what? I'm gonna probably need to go to pick up my boy. I, I should hope so. I mean... I know! Time to get a bloody bus pass. <laughs> Damn. Oh, Damn, you did him dirty. <laughs> this makes me sad. <laughs> oh, no cloud. <laughs> uh. I'm going to have to go to the bottle store just to... <laughs> no, Kiwi. The bottle store? You mean the off license, right? <laughs> well, I thank yeah, everybody I... for being here. I appreciate it. <laughs> I appreciate I'm gonna, it. I'm gonna leave the stream going. Here. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Yes. Well, thank you so much for showing up. Anyway, I very much appreciate it, and I hope that maybe I will Dude, see I'm you not guys. Going. In the I just ring up Steve and he'll go here and run there. <laughs> Just, I'm not oh, going. I mean, I'm leaving the stream going. I'm just gonna have to get out of voice chat for a while. Okay. What the hell happened? To this you road? tell Jarky we said oh, hey. So ugly. I will. All right. Let's do. <laughs> you know what? There. So that's a four lane road and a two lane road. Be safe, Chris. Yeah, I wish. Yes, oh, it is it is too late. It is, huh? Yeah. I yeah, will. There it is. Nope. I need to turn my YouTube down. I'm getting a voice repeat. Well, I can't come up to this area because it's where the um, the forestry industry is. But I can come in to right here, maybe. Maybe look better. Okay, you know why you, you don't better. have a forestry industry because you keep putting things down and, and, and trees aren't growing. Well, I, I understand that. That's why I'm not going to dig into this area too much more. Um, I may have to probably come out and square this off a little bit for more residential as we're getting more demand up here. Or I'll just probably end up buying uh, new tiles and or buying or building up to here. Actually, we could do that. Probably put a little little curvy area in this area Excellent. and have uh, beachfront or I mean uh, uh, lakefront property on the bit along the river the fjord you like fjord I like fjords fjord fjord right. fjord <laughs> fjord kichiki burki I love Swedish Chef, dude. Swedish Chef is, is my jam. Hey, it's so funny, isn't it? <laughs> and put the lobster into the pot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going to do this the smart way this time. Which, if we were doing this the smart way, you probably wouldn't be watching me. Um, that being said, we're going to <laughs> save the game. County, I can't remember which one it was. We're going to go with... This one and save and save. Drive to see if Delta. Oh. All right. Have oh. Hey, have a great one. Be careful. Driving time. You guys going on vacation again? Well, either way, be safe out there. Hope uh, uh, Delta daughter gets better soon and gets uh. She'll be. She'll be fine. She will be fine. Right, it's to 50% yeah, here. Yeah, kids back quick. They do, especially from the shots. Love you, dude. Stay safe. Especially from the shots. I will I will say that. It's large enough. Yeah, she'll be healthy again before Delta is. <laughs> is that going to be... This This should be... What if we could probably go with this. I think there's still no, a, no, no, a no, slope no. there, isn't here? there? Yeah, what the heck? 
No, I want it up here. I'm trying to basically make it as large as that depot. That way I don't have to build... I don't mind building down uh, into the train tracks from the depot. Because I mean, if we're going to put the depot in, then it needs to be as even or as level, I would hope. Although, the way that this allowed me to build these lines in was effortlessly. It was... It, it still blows my mind how easy that was. So maybe I don't even need to do all this, right? I don't know. Hey guys, I'm just going to jump out of voice check for a bit. Oh, all right. Have okay, a good one. Mind? Be careful out there. I have a visitor. People actually visit me in real life. What? Real people? <laughs> I what don't know. Right? Right? You, you know yeah, people? People, yeah. <laughs> Wait, yeah, I know people? As as you guys. <laughs> they're just as weird as us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, then they're in good company. Okay, guys. I'll talk to you in a minute. All right. I'll jump back in. that. All right. So maybe come out this way. Let's test this out. So, yeah, I want to dig that back up. I'll, I'll smooth it back out afterwards. But let's see how that looks yeah. with it in first. Rail yard. Yeah, that's something that, like, that would look good, though, anytime wouldn't it? I was watching, yeah, like, any time I was watching anyone, like, doing, you know, building in this game, like, they always seem to be very adverse to having, like, cliff faces showing. Oh, and I no. I think that, like... I don't, I don't have... I, I, I know what you're talking about. No, no, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, and I don't have a problem with like that. Just, I just like, want them to look a little bit more natural. Like, this right now looks yeah, almost natural like enough. Yet. Right? I've lived in Arizona, yeah. and this, you know what I mean? There's tons of cliffs in a lot of different areas. It's a, there's certain portions of Arizona that are very, very rocky, and, and very, it's part of the Rocky Mountain, the uh, part of the lower part of the uh, Rocky yeah. Mountain chain. So you do get a lot of that, and it, I have no problem with that. In fact, I love that. That's one of the things that I love most, even though I've lived in a lot of other places on the planet. The mountains views that you get in Tucson, in Phoenix, in... Uh, Casa Grande in the different, you know, even in, in whether you're even if you're in Northern California or I mean Northern Arizona, especially there's I mean, you're surrounded by everything at that point. You can go out to visit the crater if yeah. you want. You can go uh, Behringer Crater. You can go out and visit the the uh, world famous Grand Canyon, which is I words and pictures that you see online or in books. They don't do it justice. You have to yeah. visit yeah. the Grand Canyon and see it with your own eyes to truly understand the majesty and the raw power of nature and the storybook that the Grand Canyon is because their history is written all in that strata. It's all there. You I had a very interesting conversation with um, a guy, one of, my, one of my friend's fathers, actually. I, uh, I found out that like one of his lifelong dreams is to go and visit the Grand Canyon. So, you know, I would love to go there as well. So I got talking to him about it and I was asking, you know, what would you like to do? He wants to do a helicopter ride over it. Yeah, they can do that. Um, they do that. I was, yeah, but this oh, wow. is where we got into the discussion and it took me a while to kind of get him around to my way of thinking because he just, he was like, no, I want to just like see it from a helicopter and like see the grandeur of it and all this. And my point was like, yeah, that would be cool, but I would like to get down into it. Into it. Like, okay, now horse. that's actually, you can do yeah. that too. It is uh, it is not cheap to do, by the way. Just want to put that out there. Yeah. Um, but I'm willing to bet mm -hmm. everything it is well worth it because of that. I have never done the, the whitewater rafting on it. <sighs> now you're going to make me hurt you cry a little bit because I'm not, I'm not in that state anymore. <laughs> oh, that, I want to do that. But I also want to jet ski down the... the uh, down the Colorado River in Laughlin, mm -hmm. go out, go out to Nevada and jet ski down the river because they do offer that too. And man, let me tell you, last time I was in Laughlin, that looked like so much fun, so much fun. Oh, yeah. What is this? What is that error? What is that saying? No. Yeah, I like a bit of white water in the As long as I'm in a kayak. <laughs> what? Can I come out this way? Welcome no, in, chat. SK99. Here and there. So why is it saying it needs road access? Aren't these part of the asset? I, I didn't put these down. Aren't these? 
Oh, road access there. Oh, I see. All right, so that means that this... Uh, okay, I can fix this. I can fix this. This actually doesn't look that bad, by the way. Here, you know what? I'm going to swap out. Give me just a second. Because the keyboard... Or the, the camera controls are so much easier with the controller. And I can show you and then do what I need to do building with the keyboard and mouse, I guess. That's a compromise. All right. Ah, there we go. So yeah, just the, the hassle of switching between the two, I suppose. Yeah, I well, I mean, I got a large enough desk. Thankfully, just gonna move the mount, uh, the camera, or the microphone over. Okay, so this actually doesn't look as bad as I thought it was going to. Let's take the HUD completely off. Um, that's a hell. <laughs> it's a hell of a hell of a an incline with a truck, but. It can be done, yeah, but right? You get things like that, yeah. Um, you know that this is the thing about like whenever whenever people are building things like this, like they have to work with the terrain. So if someone was building this in real life, like they would probably Ooh. build a big old access road like that, as opposed to like level and everything, right. just to get a little access road in. Exactly, exactly. So this is still not level with this somehow. Um, let's go there. All right, let's get rid of this one. Okay, that makes no sense. What the hell? Oh, all right. Uh, I'll just go with that. Why does it say that that's valid? I can't go with that. That's weird. Why does it say that that's valid? Okay, how about this side? Rear. Okay, let's not do that. Okay. <laughs> Let me just say, I've never seen roads like this in reality, and if I did, I would go. I I would probably have a have an aneurysm. That is weird. I like it, interesting, but here's the other idea that I wanted that I was thinking of doing. I have an idea. We shall see if it works. I have a cunning plan. <laughs> Baldrick. <laughs> if we go here, All right there's that. Here I'm back on the controller at least for now. Uh, let's get rid of this, and if we go to a one way, we can do a three lane one way. What I'm thinking is we can after the trucks drop off over here inside the train uh, or work because these are just for the workers actually yeah because the cargo train never mind but that's fine we can still do it um now we have to go under i'm going to try to see if i can take it underground why is it not what is it you always say um do it do it you can do it <laughs> You can do it all night long. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it's not that. What is? It, I thought it was page up and page down. Okay, that is. The, ah, there we go. That is so weird. Why is it so weird? All right. Let's try that then, I guess. That runs in there. Oops. Overlapping items. So it can't overlap? That doesn't make any sense. All right, that's not gonna work. All right, or at least I don't wanna, I'll fuss with that off camera where I don't have to get frustrated or whatever the case may be, right? Just, it's just easier. I was thinking of trying to bring a road under or have it come back under so that workers, when they're done, um, could A, come back out here. There would be a parking lot, too. So maybe it wouldn't have to be a one-way. They could park here, and then I could have even a small shuttle or a taxi service that takes them back out to the rail yard if I need to. But now that we have this, let's go with the... It's a double, right? This one right here. And do a curve. At least for now. Because then... <clears throat> T. 
15, and there's 135, right? So that's as close as I can get to what would be a 45 coming out of that. If you 90 degree to the main track, will it put in a curve for you? I may have to come back out further. Uh, exceed city limits. If you find 90 degrees, you said to it. Yeah, if you just 90 degree it, what what oh, does the game I see do? What happened. Does it just a, put like a 90 degree speed. track on? You know what? And let's not do the let's not do the the big track. Let's do the small track. Let's try that instead. Um, because if you if I don't hit the wrong button, that'd be helpful. Um, if you notice, there's two here. They're not really labeled though. Do these have to come up and I'm really confused by how this look I unfortunately the one thing that the I guess I live in a state now that's that used to be a rail expert or uh, a, a major portion of rail in the United States but rail isn't used for very much now except for freight pretty much from what I understand there's very few passenger lines still running in the United States so help me to understand this if you don't mind I assume because this is the railway, this is where the warehouse for the actual uh, train for the uh, engines and the cars are. Did, does this have to wrap back around into these additional lines? And then come back mm -hmm. out? Yeah, it, it, it seems, yeah, the, the warehouse only has tracks out one side, so that would be, those tracks would need to be um, attached to a line. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I suppose a quick way of doing it would be to loop them back around onto the lines that are beside themselves. Yeah. You can so loop them back. Like into them run this too. one around into here and then run this one up and over around into here, for example. You think? Did I did I go too slow on that? Oh, you guys got to wait. I would. Yeah. So like the top loop the ones that to out the of first the single line, which would be this one going out and coming in which means this one's still going to be you're right i'm going to have to run this parallel to the others regardless of how i do this that's the easiest way to do it all right mm. well i'm glad you we're played this pause. before sk yeah no i just saw videos about it uh -huh. i appreciate it sk and um, no maxi i appreciate that too they... he, he was the one who told me initially to put it 90 degrees anyway let's just reload you can, uh, you don't have to connect it in both ways, but you have to loop the ends. They have to be looped around? Okay, thank you. I appreciate that. That you would can be helpful. Either connect it from oh, you know what? That's probably in the damn tutorials that I turned side. off. You turned off the tutorials? Well, because, well, I mean, <laughs> I turned the tutorials off because I'm used to City Skylines. So, I mean, by and large, for this initial City portions. City Skylines 1. <laughs> Yes, this I is am. not a city skyline one, so. I know, I know. I, I, yeah, I think, mistakes. I think for, I think for a game like this that you know, you're having to relearn and it's all very new. I think it's okay to have the tutorials on because it it means that the people that are watching are also learning along with you. Yeah, absolutely right. I and think, normally I, think it's I would okay do in that. that sense, you know. And normally yeah, I, would I think do for that. an established game like CS One, you know. Yeah, turn the tutorials off because you know what you're doing there and it's just going to slow it all down. But with this, it's okay to slow it down, I think, because it's so new. Well, let me run around here. I guess the other part of it, the other pressure that goes along with that, though, uh, Max, you can let's take us here, actually. Let's find a vehicle to follow while we while we just chat. I, oh, i got to be moved. they got to be paused. Can, it's can going to be a cop again. Uh, that's another tile. Um, so you run out of time. I, I can buy more tiles. That's not a problem. I mean, we've got our, we've got enough money right now, and we're not losing a lot, thankfully. Um, maybe I can readjust because the tax values here soon the too. Tile next to it. But and uh, that, have it there, I guess. Let's go to general. Because I think that wasn't it in here that you can turn the tutorials. Yeah, turn to turn turn the yeah, the tutorials back on. So now those are back on as well. Uh, in fact, we'll save the game again. Um, 
But to answer Maxi Bloke, the other portion of that too, the other reason I, I may not have done that is because they're, I don't know, it's that I know I'm not Biffa, right? Biffa plays indie games. I know I'm not City Planner plays. I know I'm not Overcharged Egg. But I still would like to try to get to that same point. And so there's a portion of you that doesn't want to put those additional things. Not, not, I mean, I, I'm all for showing my mistakes. Obviously, I have no problem doing that. Mm. But uh, some of the other stuff I thought maybe I, I just thought I was uh, smart enough to be able to do it uh, without needing the crutch of the tutorials, which I clearly needed to use and should have used from the beginning. So you're yeah, both no, right. The you're looking at it you're looking at it wrong you're looking at the tutorial as a crutch whereas it's not all it's doing is giving you the real the relevant information of like the new mechanics for a new game it's it's not a crutch i mean you you look at it it tells you something you've then learned that and then whenever you've learned all the bits and bobs that you need to know then yeah. you turn it off i'm sure that those guys that you just mentioned have like whenever they've started the game they've they've looked at the buttons and that they you know they haven't just gone oh I magically know how to do this like they've looked at stuff they just haven't broadcast that they've done that oh right yeah no i can that's well, this is more like a this is more like a you know a live come and watch me learn this game and and like learn it with me and you know there's going to be mistakes and whenever there are mistakes and stuff goes wrong then we can look at well how do we fix these things which is to me another would like thing to learn about this game because it's not gonna go smoothly we we all know yeah. from city skylines it goes smoothly until it doesn't until it doesn't and then all hell smoothly. breaks loose what yeah so I that like learning this? that like uh, the ability to be able to chase problems and and fix issues you know that that's got to have some value too well that's what i'd like to hopefully teach you know ultimately yeah. But that's what I teach in my other in other games like uh, uh, Star Traders Frontiers or Cyber Knights or any of the other games that mm. I like to do. That's one of the benefits that I, I do is that I may not do traditional top 10 things I wish I knew before I played this game type of videos or, uh, you know, I, I, I even did a horrible tips and tricks video years ago. So it's the matter of learning those uh, learning my voice uh, as well uh, and the kind of content that I want to point out. But I like to give out tips and tricks as I'm playing. With City Skylines 1, I was able to do it on the uh, from the console because I put so many hours off camera in learning so that I could give those and thinking about how I would phrase them so that I could give that advice in real time or in in uh, service to the content itself, helping other creators out. I get you. Yeah, I get you. Yeah, it, this game's different though because it's so new you haven't put in the um like all those hours yet and you know if you if you want to be playing instead of like learning it all in the background first if you want to be doing this live then i think that you know doing it as a like a live tutorial i think that that's okay i think you know i don't i don't think people will mind that mm -hmm. you know if, if they wanted to t tune in to watch you build a fully established city and all that like so that's fine we're not at that point yet it's a new game you're you're just new on it we're just not at that point yet so this is all the pre that point stuff and i think it's okay to you know sh show it all and and you know like the tutorial stuff it you know you're only going to use it once you might actually have to come back to it if, it, if it's a complicated system you'll probably have to come back to it and remind yourself once or twice about certain things but when you get it it it's got you know then switch it off then play because you'll have the answers already stored that that you need thank you whereas at the minute with it turned off you're trying to grasp its straws in the dark more you know it's, i agree i agree it's no i appreciate be more that frustrating for you to try and and work out a problem when you don't fully know what like the problem is the or how to get around it well having this it. yeah uh this yeah. how to build a city to having that tutorial up there i probably wouldn't have gotten frustrated earlier or uh you know and tried to figure it out but i'm mean, that's that's the type of person that i am i can go through and read it if i want but it was more of like there's slow things oh that's right there's a symmetry here i forgot completely about that too uh, so we're going to protect that one pro welcome planes in. welcome back actually 
So Pro Up Plains was in one of the earlier uh, 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 Catterday streams, and uh, he had a, if I remember correctly, it was a fishing uh, industry uh, named after him. No. Yeah, it was a fishing industry named after him. Pretty sure. Because I didn't have the uh, airport unlocked someone yet. From, I'll have to get someone from Maxi Bloke Heights to, to reach out for some protection money. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> yep. All right, so I did remove the entire the train. Um, by the way, hold on real, real quick, Maxi. I did get rid of the train completely. So this is something mm -hmm. that maybe when I come back to it, we, I can revisit. But the and the and this might actually help with the budget overall, too. Now, obviously, we're back up to 2,500 deficit per week, but it's a far cry from the 200,000 it was before. And we can look into yeah. <laughs> starting to grow a little bit better. Now, uh, yeah, because you know, with the with at least with City Skylines one, like it is an absolutely a game that has to be attacked slowly, 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 and it's it's a game that it it kind of draws you in to making big moves, to expanding quickly. It it does it to me too. I, you know, I'll be like, right, I'm I'm focusing on this little area today, and and I'm gonna get it working, and and then all of a sudden I've built like another half of the city and it's mm -hmm. like oh my god now i've got to deal with traffic i've got to deal with um like a million buses being on the line and you know all the added stuff that comes with expanding too quick right um, so if this game's the same i would say yeah slow it way down okay all take right, it one cool. step at a time i'm, I'm and, glad you go, i'm glad way through you're giving me that feedback actually because you know it's 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 doing uh streaming especially right it's that it feels it has to constantly be active there to uh there has to be something yeah, exciting could, yeah. going on um to be able to keep people's attention keep you know keep them going on not enough customers yeah what would i I'll rate you what would that's I... probably more true for like a, a faster paced game but this is this is cities this is chill this is let's let's do a nice relaxing you know, build, basically. Services. Okay, I, don't, so I don't think that people come here for high octane. They're probably not coming to my channel for high octane content anyway. Not your channel. I mean, come to watch a city. <laughs> oh, I know. Guy I know. Stream for high octane. Well, I don't, it depends. Know. If it's like if it's a challenge, <laughs> if it's a challenge or not. That's a whole different story. Um, you said education is key. So what I did based on that is I did upgrade the the education there. But let's take a look really quick at the education overall because by now I should have actually been looking at a how what are we where are we at and how do we keep going? Because you're right. There's a squirrel mode that you get into. Uh, in City Skylines 1, and I've already felt it here as well, Maxi. You get so focused, laser focused on, I'm trying to get this area to look really pretty. And I mean, maybe you'll even slow down enough to where you'll put the, the, the speed on normal speed, and you're in prop mode, and you're just putting small props down. And then next thing you know, you zoom out, and you're like, yes, oh man, that's so pretty. And then this, you, you happen to look over, and there's a giant... Um, uh, back up on the freeway and a bunch of your roads, you know, locking up the, you know, half the city. It happens, right? <laughs> so, I, yeah, yeah, absolutely. It, it's good. To, it's good to hear that there's going to be, you know, that that is something that you still would like to see that granular uh, minor details on. Um, but going back up here, let's look yeah, at education. Man. So education out of fifteen hundred elementary I think students. In oh, go ahead. I was just going to say, I think in the long run, it, it'll be much more fun to watch the stream and watch you gradually expand the city as opposed to watching a few initial um, streams where you expand at a massive rate and then the later streams are just you chasing problems. It'll be hilarious for us to watch you chase problems, but, right. you know, for, for a streamer point of view, it you know, it's, well, even... it, it'll be better to like progress gradually. I think. Wow. Yeah, there's no education on this. Welcome side. back, Kiwi. Okay, so they're all living on the wrong side of the tracks. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. It can. We should probably put in another That's elementary school. That's Coach Kid Bro, baby. <laughs> we should actually probably put in another elementary school over here. Oh, actually, what about the one? Oh, it's too big. All right. Okay, go away. 
Oh, come on. Put a school right next to a federal prison. <laughs> <laughs> that actually, did we do that in Maxi Bloke Heights? I swear we did. I know there's a prison there. Yeah, we did. Because Maxi yeah. said he took it over yeah. and he, he, he rents it out. Uh, yeah. He has, he has birthday, <laughs> kids' birthday parties there. <laughs> um, yeah, no no cops, uh, no fire protection, <laughs> no <yeah>. buses. <laughs> nothing. Ain't nothing. Uh, let's go back here. And, and, still, that. and still, you can only like, get three invites. <laughs> it's a scared it's, straight it, program it like on possible. steroids. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, same as like, how many bus lanes should I put up in Maxi Blow Kites? And I was like, none. Are you, are you crazy? He's like, none? Are you serious? I'm like, yeah, it's Maxi Blow Kites. No, you can you can come here, but you can never leave. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this fills up. Okay. All right. So now I now I understand. Okay. So these actually fill up, and that's the the same bar down here. I a retard. <laughs> All right. So. Uh, that's what medium language. No, I'm a retard. Save okay. your money. Since I, I, says save your money, since a college is the most important. I I agree. I agree. So we are going to add a little bit more residential here. We've got 1.6 mil. We're only losing a little over about five right now. We can afford to expand just a bit more. Got and at this point, I don't really care how straight things are or not. It's going to be fine. It'll work itself out. <laughs> oh, you take the fun out of everything, son. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know. Trust me, my, my ex-wife told me that. Uh, my You're girlfriend right. told me that before she went to work. Uh, uh, yeah. Thanks for the reminder. Appreciate it. <laughs> 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 Wait, actually, I do even better than that. That right stuff, right? Where is it at? That Where right is it at? Right. No. There it is. <laughs> oh, God. All right, so. <laughs> the zoning industry. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and so go into zoning and say really hard to throw a wrench. Like really hard. Zoning allows for different materials to create material goods or can be further processed by other industries, sold by commercial businesses or used by city services. Zoning for industrial manufacturing. So this is using the actual industries down below. Right, the, the, oh no, this one, specialized. Okay, so this isn't the same thing. Um, startup, business, startup businesses, industrial companies are dependent on materials, so they work best near resources and benefit. What, where'd it go? Okay, never mind. I didn't hit the button. It just, <laughs> it just disappeared on me. It pressed itself. <laughs> All right, you know, yeah, yeah, that was great. Uh, that's a great tutorial there. All right. My game's haunted. It's playing itself. Electricity. <laughs> Let's just shoot through this, because honestly, at this point, I think the only well, one I'm really worried about is the. Be... Enough. <laughs> well, the, the pop-ups are kind of infuriating. I'm not gonna lie about that. Yeah. Boy, my name's Pop Up. How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> How you doing? Transformer Station. Hey. We've already Steven done that. Adam I think. Yeah, we have a Transformer home. Station. Oh, I, oops. Hold on just a sec. <sighs> Stress. No, Diamante, why is... Wait, did I... Transformer lines. Di he, are you talking about what Diamante Yeah, what was he doing? saying? He's, he's trying to... He No, he, he has created a command to throw a wrench, and now he's trying to edit it. Oh, okay. Electricity. Flow through the city, help you spot weaknesses Did and solve problems. he just throw a wrench into its wrench prime program? <laughs> he's he's <laughs> trying his best to, to throw a wrench, at least. <laughs> wow, yeah. See, the so the... 
even the uh, utilities are dramatically much more in depth here. Like the electricity flow is in depth too. Mm. Very in depth. Wow. Okay. Oh, cable capacity. Yeah. Ooh, so you're gonna have to have different capacities for different like industry and things like that, depending on how much power they're drawn. Interesting. Right. Efficiency of 73% of this transformer station has a capacity of 80 megawatts, and each of these turbines are pulling off. Oh, 3.65, but they also have upgrades I didn't upgrade them with. But based on what uh, Divante and uh, Pro at Planes have mentioned is that we probably do not need to worry about um, doing those upgrades right now just so that we can save some money, ultimately. Yeah, well, what is your, um, what is your Hang time, on, I, say, I, you I know, your pause, usage? pause the game for a minute because I really want to see um, how... Devonta gets out of this. <laughs> the wrench is winning. Oh no! Yep. <laughs> the wrench is winning. <laughs> Remove command. <laughs> the, the wrench is winning. <laughs> the wrench is kicking your butt, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Apparently, you can't dodge a wrench. Demon <laughs> Warlord. Welcome to chat. Demon Warlord? Yeah, that's my buddy. Hey, welcome, Demon Warlord. Welcome, everybody. Thank you guys all so welcome. much for coming out today. I appreciate it. How we you appreciate doing, you. Well, at least that makes Jim one Bob? of us. Oh, God, I've always wanted to meet a Jim Bob. Oh, muted right Jamie, now. be very careful. It's Maxi on the line. So Water pumping you better station. put your headphones on and come and terrorize them. <laughs> I'm the devil in disguise. For your sign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, God, is Christy still involved. in the chat? She's going she's gonna to clip that. You know she's going to clip that. If you, yeah, yes. you, you done, you done, you done oh. it, man. You done it now. I done done me, you stupid. Uh, hold on, I've got to go check on Ryoki because I can hear. Her. Give me it just a moment, guys. Super does. Hear her crying in the background. <laughs> Stephen Eddington says the wrench is strong with this one. <laughs> Don't try to it. <laughs> I can't believe it. Just leave it alone, Dibble. When Christy gets back, she'll fix it. <laughs> fix it that's that's an optional word <laughs> fix it break it quote it <laughs> awesome. we'll keep fixing it till it breaks yo one of my favorite youtubers uh her her um it's not really a it's kind of something that she lives by it's like if you see something broken and you fix it and it breaks again and you fix it like all we have to do is fix it one more time than it breaks and the world will be a better place sometimes broken things don't want to be fixed thank you Todd Howard uh, <laughs> Burn. <laughs> <laughs> you keep leaving these windows I go through <laughs> I think their bondy has been through every combination with a space with no space exclamation no exclamation <laughs> at range oh, not at range <laughs> Like I said, let's pause the game and just watch this. This is much more entertaining. Yeah, dude. <laughs> he's, he's, he's gonna get to the point where he's just gonna go to the shed, get a wrench, come into the house and throw it at the TV. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we are making fun of you, Dave. <laughs> it works. You can make it who's too, throwing too the damn wrench. <laughs> too easy. <laughs> Should have given him a banana, not a French. 
<laughs> Go, you sit in the corner and snack on that. We'll we'll do the mod <laughs> stuff. <laughs> you sit in the corner with a cookie and we'll wait for crust. <laughs> I can't type properly, so I'm not even going to try and pick. Well, I like voice chatter. You're not throwing one. <laughs> Nothing's happened. <laughs> I think it's stuck to a team. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, throwing implies that you're gonna let it go at some point. <laughs> Like that experiment where you know the, you put your hand in the jar, but you grab it and take out of the jar. Put your hand in the jar, and what? Well, you can put your hand in the jar when you are grabbing. Oh it. yeah, ah okay, yeah, making the fist. <laughs> yeah. Don't scab on. I only got Oreos and nip nip sitting in. <laughs> Yes, we knew there were drugs involved here, but... <laughs> it's not working because it's not a wrench, it's a spanner. Just <laughs> <laughs> oh, <well. laughs> <laughs> to make things better. All right, so, pile completed. In. Whoa! <laughs> to the fire and rescue panel. Are we this one? No, wait. No. Is that fire and rescue? Oh, fire and rescue. It is. Wait. It didn't pop up on screen. Oh, wait. There it is. Fire and rescue responds. Fire damages buildings. Oh, so there isn't an accident right now. Don't freak me out like that. It said that there was an accident. Oh, okay, let's go to the accident. Nope. Nope. No, no, no. The accident is still Dave on it. <laughs> <laughs> the accident is the city, it feels like. Diavante, dunce cap on, yeah, handing on out Oreos and Nip Nips sitting in the corner. In the head. <laughs> That's me in the corner. That's me with Nip Nip. Losing my confession. Professor Cynical. Ghetto Refic Living Square. Why do we Clip it. even live? <laughs> Here. <laughs> we all know it's possible, but we still make complete idiots of ourselves online. <laughs> Look, if you give men any Consider opportunity, this. there's a very likelihood Consider we're gonna this. make a, we're gonna make idiots of ourselves. That's kind of it, this, not this intentionally. This is why we don't use our real names online. <laughs> yeah, oh, I love that. Yeah, one. about why that. <laughs> That's a great idea. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's just he that's doxed himself and been doxed several times. <laughs> the good, the, the best part about it, I mean, if, if you don't have anything to lose, then, do you know what I mean? Once yeah, you've lost so many things, you really don't have much of a, of a need to lose. You know, or you don't have... You know. mm -hmm. Oh, there's the snow coming in, Sen. Oh, is it? Oh, it is snowing! It's in, oh, yeah, check it out! Your, okay, you this is the cool. The map, it's already white. Let's get pictures too. We're gonna get pictures. Oh, I'm not. I'm gonna use the. I'm just gonna Christmas use steam. And crap I'm gonna use stuff. Oh, that's a beautiful shot of the industrial. <laughs> 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 is that snow or is it cocaine? The answer is yes. <laughs> Do you have more? <laughs> That's the, best. That's the only answer to that question. <laughs> we at Sins Arcade do not oh. condone the use of drugs. That's right. Absolutely. Stay clean, kid. We are not. I'm not. I'm not no it's officer, it's candy. It's a bag of, sugar. It's a bag it's of just sugar. Honestly. <laughs> Man, this. <laughs> actually, this looks like a very. This looks like the most don't haphazard. Don't be the one with morals, okay? This looks like the most haphazard. <laughs> oh, look. You can see it growing in. Okay, that's cool. Okay, that's that's pretty sick. Okay, that was pretty neat. I ain't gonna lie, that was cool. You know what I what I found fun about that whole thing was um, Maxie is the least morally ambiguous out of that chat at the moment. 
<laughs> and him struggling with it. Where's a cop car? Why do I not <laughs> see no, anybody I... else on the street? Dude, are all the cars that are driving covered in snow? Yeah, too? they're all covered in snow. This is a sedan <laughs> covered in snow. Welcome to Coke Dan. <laughs> This is a cop car covered in snow, right? No, this is a this is just a sedan. This isn't a cop. Oh no, the streams, the streams behind. Oh, you, you were on a cop. Yeah, well, I want to go do it because it's always a cop car that I see driving around. So I was trying to grab one that wasn't a cop car. <laughs> Why are you always on high alert for cops, Sen? That's not even that, man. What have you done, bro? I got a prescription. It's okay. Fair Calm right. down. I I've got a prescription. <laughs> Through my glaucoma. <laughs> I got bronchitis. That is definitely <laughs> Chicago. Nobody knows I how to clean the snow off food. their windows. Rolled yep. <laughs> is that Eddington? Is this uh, Miss Your Seep? Just what we needed. The whole nother personality. Oh. Or was I just hearing that? Oh, no. He's... The, she, there's like seven of them in there. Personalities, I mean. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> no, there's more than that. <laughs> Oh my goodness, Remember, Max. I can clone myself constantly. <laughs> Is that what you kids are calling it these days? Call yourself constantly if you want to. You can leave your friends behind. But if your friends don't clone, then if they don't clone, then they're no friends of mine. <laughs> oh my god. No, no, Sin, no, you gotta sing it. You have to sing it. I did. You sang yes, all the other did. one. I just did. No, come on. Yeah. You got to do the music parts too. <laughs> no. Nah. <laughs> nah. All right, so that's cool there. What? There you have. There I you dare have. Me. There you draw the line. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's, it's a mile. This is the line. Yeah. No <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Picard. <laughs> you know my favorite part about people drawing a line in the sand? It's always crooked. It's sand. You can just rub it out. <laughs> I, I knew a girl like that once. <laughs> oh, God. Hey, have old, you loaded number three into your head? <laughs> no. <laughs> nah. <laughs> I warned you about using that subroutine. How about nah? Okay, let's do the happiness tutorial, apparently. What about yeah? Are you my dad? Do I look like I went for coffee? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, son. I'll be back in like 30, 45 years. Tops. Yeah, I'm just going for cigarettes. You don't smoke, dad. I'm going for cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Somebody's going to need therapy after this one. Probably gonna be me. I, I think we are therapy. <laughs> therapy before this one. <laughs> uh, let's add some back on the controller, but let's add in some more industrial uh, demand, and then now I do like that because then like the L1, R1 buttons, the top buttons, swap back and forth between the different categories. That's the one thing I have to really give oh, them dude. mad prep or prop for is that even on PC, because they were planning to launch on console, the console um, <clears throat> uh, schematic, the the key ma the key mapping is all legit. It's just like playing on PlayStation Four, PlayStation Five. I'm not pretty much. Now you have to go between all of these, and you can come down to these, which you could not do on on the other on the older consoles. Um, and you don't have like the, the triangle maps or, you know what I mean? You have the whole triangle down or any of those things. Um, and then if I hit the touchpad, for example, on the, cause I'm using a PlayStation 4 controller, I'm not using a Steam controller. Um, with touchpad, it just pulls up the, the start menu. So it's pretty close though. I have to give them some credit there. Um, you see, we're asking about offices. That's a large zone for offices. I wanted to. Nice try, Did there, Bumpy. And try again. Get right. So, Diavante, I think you need to put... This becoming interesting. Yeah. Man, this... I think... I'm so glad that I have the 
everybody can watch all of this on demand and watch Diavante fail over and over and over again with this round. <laughs> I know. It's almost as entertaining as the conversation about it. <laughs> Love you, Diavante. <laughs> oh, 07, brother. Oh, 07. Oh, 07, oh, seven brother. Oh, 07. Keep going there, Monty. <laughs> Isn't that the definition of insanity is trying the same thing over and over again and expecting a different result? <laughs> All right. Let's go Don't here. give up. There's that. There's that. There's this. Keep going, Already dude. Dead. You'll get there. You can do it, Skipper. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. We have an overabundance of electricity, so we're selling the access to the outside world. Holy cow. We're oh, actually... Gee. We're actually, we're actually in a positive budget. How do you budget. do that with no internet? What the hell? I don't know. We're making money now. We're making money now. <laughs> but, yeah, but how do you how do you sell electricity with no uh, internet? No, it's there is a connection. Hold on, there is a connection. Hold on, let me show you real quick. Let me get through this really uh, fast. Monthly oh, budget. Did, did, I have to did go you back. take care of that? So yeah. So what? Um, so here's the coal power plant, which I had to add because. Um, these uh, uh, turbines weren't enough. Here is the transformer station. And then I hate this view. I wish they wouldn't use this view. It's so hard to make out the differences. Okay, so here's where the power lines, the, the high voltage power lines come in, right? Notice they have the, the actual high voltage power line uh, towers. Then they come into the yep. towers themselves that those go into the transformer station, but all of the wind turbines um, are on the, are, are going to the transformer station itself. And then the transformer station, let me see if I can go to a different view and see if it looks, no, there's under, wrong. There's underground wires. Okay, yeah, I guess this will work. So notice, there you go, there's better. So this shows the high voltage cables coming in. Um, then the transformer station here, then this line goes out to the closest road, which is Holly Street, which just plugs right into the network itself. The fact that the uh, coal power plant is also along it, notice that it has its own transformer built into the asset itself. So those go directly into here as well. And all it was asking for, which I didn't have to connect, but the other way around, um, was the high voltage over here by running an additional high voltage line back over so I can get the maximum amount of power. So now we're running, what is that, a deficit, or a, a, about a little over, tw or under 28? Yeah, just under 28. So we're in the, you gotta start being fairly cautious zone, meaning we have to think about putting either another wind turbine up, or I really don't wanna put another uh, coal power plant up, and I'm not sure if this one has, yeah, I don't think this one has any, uh, I don't think this is one of the modular buildings. I don't think this one can be added onto. Um, oh, shh. Some of them you can. I can also build, I think, I don't, oh, I don't have it unlocked yet. Uh, the reason I know about it is because I have an unlimited save as well that I was testing off camera. Um, where is it? The emergency battery station here. This is pretty cool too. So this we could have, for example, if we decide, which we're probably not going to because I don't like coal, but if we were having, if we're going to keep the coal plant, then we could put an emergency battery station next to it and it would just fill up and, and hit the, once the batteries were full, if for whatever reason, we started running lower on the, uh, on the production value over here, then that battery would, that battery backup would help us sustain over until we could get a replacement turbine or some other advanced power plant further in that, uh, to shore up that loss. Hope I said that correctly. Do they work underwater? No. A wind turbine? No. <laughs> no. Oh, the emergency battery. Uh, I don't think they do. What are you planning? We're not doing a monsoon, okay? No monsoon, no tsunamis. No, <laughs> we're not flooding the Crook County at this point, please. Trust me. Is it flooding <laughs> if it's planned? <laughs> they don't even have canals in Spring so clean. maybe oh that being said i'm very sorry but i have to go um my friend started a party and i've just realized that that was an hour ago 
Oh, wow. No, no, no. Yeah. I, hey, you thank you so me. much for being here, Maxie. I appreciate it. No, thank you for having me. Thank you for having me. And thanks for answering all the questions. It's, it's really interesting. I haven't got this game yet, but I think at some point I'm going to get it because I really enjoyed City Skylines 1. Well, um, you probably you know, are going to get so it. Relaxed and... and I'll be covering all the yeah, stuff in know, the meantime <laughs> so that you'll have the yeah, opportunity yeah. to Maxie's learn that much more it. and I can help you when Maxie's you do get it. going to get it sooner or later. That sounds like a threat, bro. <laughs> no. I what don't. are you really I saying the there? God damn, man. I've been threatened enough this week. Thanks very much. You should stop being you then. Hey, That's it's exactly Friday night. I, I ain't said. holding anybody here, and I appreciate anybody who's willing to stick around and hang out. Oh, that's not what I wanted. That was a... That You're always a fun time, man. Have a good day, Nancy. Yeah, thanks for having me, guys. It's been a blast. Uh, have a great stream, Sin, and I'll see y'all, everyone. Or ev oh, uh, see y'all later, everyone, is what I meant to say. Because <laughs> words, right? Words yeah. are hard, English words. bro. English words, man. I'm Irish. It kill it, like, it kills me to speak it. Words are hard, bro. <laughs> words are now, real you? hard! <laughs> <laughs> hey, are you guys cold? Okay, later, everyone. Look, like... they're all this one lady's walking like she got a, a stick somewhere. What the heck? Ow, ow, my, ow, my knee. I'm sure I knee. saw Santa over by Skidrow something. Well, this is Haley Page. We should get she's an lady. adult, educated, and she's wealthy. She lives at 375 Briar Rose Street. Her, she actually does work. She works for Concilio Bombaccio. And her current destination is to go visit Damien Bite. Well, that sounds like a cool place. Where is that? Is that a, is that a girlfriend? Uh, is that what? Oh, is it inside of the shopping? That's that's pretty cool. Is it listed on the outside? Hold on, let's take a look. Oh, wrong one. This one. Uh, T. Almost meat. I guess it's not. That's pretty interesting, though. Well, okay. A little too close. At least the stonework looks good. Alright, now we'll track you. Where are you going? Uh, Jaden Espinosa is going to work. He works at Chemicalore. Chemicalore. Yeah, Chemicalore. I don't remember you making that. Must be in Skid Row somewhere. It sounds toxic. It sounds toxic, yeah. It's it absolutely oh yeah, that's gotta be that has to be a uh, an industry. Although it's nine twenty six in the morning in October. What? And he's just taking his sweet are these time. Nine thirty. How do they get up so early after staying up all night streaming? <laughs> That's a good question. I mean, if he's... Wait. Okay, so, so he's uneducated. That's what it is. Wow, so he doesn't make very much money at all. He's so happy there's no public transportation because everyone's... Yeah, that was... So bad. Well, you know what? That's, we, can, <laughs> we can amend that now. Actually, we've got enough money in the bank we could do that. And I meant to do that before with the trams, but I think at this point a bus is probably going to be the smarter play. Yeah, I think a bus is going to be the smarter play. Okay, so let's go in here. And, well, should we put in taxi? Public transportation. Different means of public taxis transportation. Probably be better. Offer convenient ways. I taxis would be better. Okay, gotcha. Uh, ooh. What is that? I think that is a taxi. A what is that? And the Wait, hold on. More after this. No, well, let me see it. Uh, different means of public transportation offer convenient ways for citizens and tourists to move around and for goods to be delivered. Well-organized public transportation decreases the traffic congestion, and it lowers the overall cost of transportation. Passenger in... in Crook County, then. <laughs> well... <laughs> yeah, we can't do that. 
<laughs> he said, definitely ain't good crook out either. Passenger transportation. Using buses, trains, ships, and airplanes for passengers lowers the cost of traveling for citizens and especially for tourists. Public transportation makes it possible for people to easily visit your city and to bring tourism revenue. Citizens using public transportation have more money to use on goods and services, and with good public transportation coverage, people can quickly move to where they need to go. So that makes me wonder... In City Skylines 1, you each person has like a certain amount of money. Because you can exploit the hell out of them with the parks. Uh, where you set up all like the, they're fully separated out between uh, residential, commercial, and industrial. And for people to be able to move between any of them, they have to take the, they have to take the, the park uh, pathways and you can charge like I think it's up to maximum $40 per trip through because you imagine going back and forth to work and you can't ride you can't drive there you can't ride a bus there you can only walk back and forth to work um, and it costs you an additional $80 a day just to walk back and forth it's, it's cheesy I mean it can work it is what it is but um, and it's an exploit but it makes me wonder if these people have more. How do I put it? It makes me wonder if these people have more money or a set certain amount of money that they have to deal with on a monthly basis. And like down here where it says that every 24 hours in game is one month, or one month is equal to 24 hours. Every time it goes to November, that's going to be another technical, uh, would be 24 hours in game if I had the day night cycle running. Um, it still will be because you can see it in the bottom left corner is showing what time it is But that makes me wonder uh, because of the way that the economy is set up and that citizens uh, In like low rent housing for example have even limited more uh, limited funds you want to set the commercial Taxes a little lower in that area. Maybe the overall tax is a little lower a little lower I mean so you really have to plan it out because they're going to need access to a welfare welfare office. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. they're going to need there's a whole lot more mind, mind messing going on for this game. Access to cheaper Everything parking. You, do, you have to think twice yeah. about yeah. Yeah, and so it's a lot more granular, way more granular. And I really like that because I like the challenge of being able to overcome that. Plus, let's be honest, City Skylines One was great for making beautiful cities. But you didn't have to manage them a whole hell of a lot once you got beyond the but the early budget issues. Once you got beyond that, you didn't really have to. I mean, it, the city would sort itself out if you got it decently enough too. Even if you had to go through a death, uh, you know, a death loop, which happens. Obviously, they do happen, um, or death wave. Excuse me. Then you could easily overcome that death wave because you'd already built up enough money and coffers in the bank. And I don't mean setting the t higher tax rate and then shooting it up to the ceiling or uh and then speeding the game up for about four minutes while you just gather you know if you exploit the hell out of your people and get the tons and tons and tons of money i mean just naturally doing it the right way and not even cheating so i it just makes me wonder i mean i'd really like how they had they have it granular in this works so using trains ships and airplanes for transporting cargo lowers the cost of shipping goods and materials so if they we go through the train route like I was hoping, then I was thinking it was better because the City Skylines 1, having a train depot or freight depot means that you can send out mass amounts of your goods all at once and export them for larger paydays. But I guess it makes sense that because it also works as for income or imports as well, this one is going to make it so that if you can't produce the materials because of how granular their industries are here, then it lowers the cost of shipping those goods in versus having them go over the road which makes sense because that's how it works in the real world too i live in the you know in the midwest which Dude, is the bread I basket cut out here we just had a bit of a, a, a shaker uh -oh. um i am put my shoes on and grab my bug out there if another one happens we might get cut off if you got it hey if you gotta go please just be no, safe no, 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 it's earthquake, yeah. <laughs> the... I'm gonna grab my, my bag, bug out bag, and put my shoes on now. That's All right. my cut off. Okay. We're used to them over here. It's not a huge deal. Well, I understand that, but still, just please be careful. That's that's not that sucks. Oh, absolutely. Oh, I'm on the top floor. Oh, you know, if I'm oh, lucky, no. I'll fall through the floor into the bar. <laughs> hey, there you go. Then 
Just hope that you're not your uh, neighbor downstairs is taking a bath. You fall in the bathtub. <laughs> There's a bar underneath. Oh, is there? Oh, they're even better. Oh, hopefully you don't yeah. fall in the bottles. The bar broke my fall. But look, I got alcohol to soothe the pain. <laughs> it took him seven days to dig him out. <laughs> off bravely. <laughs> <laughs> best day, and he didn't have to hear his wife best sa best damn seven days of his life oh i don't have a one did you, that one did oh you did that one. once i only one yep i've only it done that once something spectacular to, to take care of me now <laughs> I have done that once myself too. Okay, so let's go ahead and speed this up just a bit. I'm not going to go ho uh, hog wild and go to the maximum speed. <clears throat> We're still dealing with 1.85. Oh, we have to look at transportation. That's right. I had this uh, ADHD moment there. Oh, it's actually going into the buses now. And we're losing a little bit of money. Not much. Okay. First, you need to build a bus depot. Good place is somewhere away from high traffic and with room to expand later. Depots don't need to be in the immediate vicinity of the area where your buses operate. But bus lines do, uh, oh, do not need to pass through depots. And a single depot can supply buses from multiple lines. I think we'll put in a um, a taxi depot to it. Let me see how much that is actually first. So the taxi depot is a hundred grand. The bus depot is a hundred and fifty grand. Buses can move twenty five. Oh, that's twenty five vehicles here. Twenty vehicles here. Low no noise pollution. Upkeep of twenty one thousand two hundred eighty a month. The buses have a significantly lower upkeep. Of 47,120. It does provide some low air pollution and medium noise pollution. Hmm. Let's see what this bus depot looks like then. It said more than enough room to, to grow then, right? But I don't know what that means by growth. Is that vertical growth? Like, how? 75% go to the left. I might just build it up here. It's probably a smarter option is up here um, off of this road. Oop, road up there and right here maybe. Ah, okay. So let's do this first. Let's do this smart. Go here. Let's add a two-lane road. It's on straights. There's that. Okay, yeah. We're all good here. So let's go from here. Out to there, over, and then back down into there. Can I modify this to only be bus? Grass, wide sidewalks, crosswalks, sound barrier. Oh, there's there's the road maintenance depot? Well, okay. I'm probably going to have to use that so that... If I do have an accident, then they can go clean up the accident, too, I think. Comprises road repair, snow clearing. Oh, that might be kind of helpful, actually. What is this? Um, hey, guys, we just had another little one. Um, I'm going to up now to the boat at the moment. All right, hey, be good luck. Stay I'll, safe. Please be safe. I'll, I'll, I'll let you know how things go. Probably right. won't be anything, but um, I'll get a go. All right, be careful, Kiwi. Thank you I'll so be, much for being you. here. Bye. Bye. All right, let's go here and. Fish you and me now, Spark. Right next to that other cemetery. Will that put that in? Oh, that's weird. Okay, so. Hold on, before we do this, let's go back to here. Okay, why can't I? I just wish I could move that. That would be helpful. Okay. 
but this is not the time when I want to build that. I still have something else I need to build. Stop it. There. Now I feel better. Okay, so let's go back in here. It says there's the bus terminal. Um, bus terminal is can be upgraded with a taxi stop for extra platform and electric bus charging station. Uh, a North American bus stop sign and then a shelter. Now I do know that the, the comfort difference is uh, very much the same. And I and as a person who used to ride public transportation um, in a couple of different cities, especially larger cities, I cannot tell you enough how having one of those shelters is a phenomenal thing. Now I haven't ever ridden the bus inside of a city where it snows. Uh, at least not in a long time. So I can most certainly say that those shelters are probably actually enclosed too. Usually, I think, aren't they? I mean, maybe. Either way. Depends on where you are. Yeah. Um, so that would probably be what I'm going to do is go with those. Those are $350 more. But in my personal opinion, I think that that comfort value of 40 versus 10 um helps swing that balance and justifies the additional $350 each bus station though um so do we even want one of those how large is that oh that's a, that, okay so that's just yeah that's not as that's just a terminal of course it says it's a terminal wake up soon all right so let's go ahead and add these stops in we want one stop for So these are almost like the, oh, okay, that is cool. Oh, wow. So I can choose which line goes through. Maybe we should plan these lines out and you, as to which roads I'm going to use to do this. Let's take a look. Um, let's go controller because I'm going to need it for this one. So let's come back out of this. <clears throat> come on, connect. All right, so this down here is our... Um, here, I'm going to pull this. Oh, that's fine. A driving advisory has been issued for the immediate area due to poor road conditions. Please exercise caution if you must drive. Okay. And try to stay off the streets until conditions improve. Lady, stop talking. This has been a local public okay, so this road right here, uh, Briar Rose Street, runs all the way around. Oh, oh, uh, sorry about that. It's, uh, they swear that is a full on Main Street, too, isn't it? It starts here. Yeah, it starts here. Does it go back over this way? Okay, it does not. So what I'm thinking is, I I, I want to try to limit the amount of lines that we have going out because I'm sure that on the other um, map that I've got, and that's an unlimited one, cer certainly. But I want to say that like the the tram line that I put out was had like two. Or, I put out three tram lines, and each of those had like three trams each so i'm wondering the buses are probably going to be fairly similar in that regard meaning that i don't want to have because i can't afford a lot right off the bat so it's probably better to have like one or two main buses um that run say from the uh, the northern portion of of over here and along mandalorian way or briar rose street um which now i realize doubles back on itself I didn't realize that. Okay. Well. <laughs> like, do you live on North Briar Rose Street or South Briar Rose Street? Or West Briar Rose Street? Okay, we need to go in and change one of these names. That's not, that's weird. Uh, but coming from up here into this area, which is all uh, medium residential, down along that into the industrial, I think that's probably a good idea. In fact, what I think we could do and get away with that is does Mandalorian Way go all the way across? Yeah, instead of you, we can go from Mandalorian Way over here, down, strictly down, and into the heart down over here, and then have the bus stops accordingly over there. And then as far as uh, maybe running a second one that runs from the Crusty Butte um, district up into up in the up by the high school so that it interconnects between those two and i'm not sure if we're going to need a third one that goes from crusty butte into that because why would you want to go all the way around the city just to go to work if you live over here right i guess um but then if we put in the taxi depot or consider the taxi depot 
then that's something as well that maybe we can it, we won't need as many buses uh, per line perhaps that's something to consider all right so let's try the first one here um, go back grab the shelter all right so let's put it roughly I, I think having halfway through I like the fact that this this looks a lot better than it did in City Skylines 1 as far as putting these in. Like to basically have one roughly in the middle of every block. Which seems fitting to me. Right there. And then one at the end of the block. End of this block. And I may have to put in additional um, pedestrian pathways. That way they can get put through. There's that one. And then it jumps. I could probably put them right. You know what? I'll put one right here. And then back. Skip one there. Have it turn left, come back around. You could probably have one have one up here. Yeah, that's actually not a bad idea. One there. And then maybe here as well. There we go. I like that. In fact, let me put let me connect these lines first. That way I have a good idea of how it goes in so that I can uh oh, I didn't bring it back around. Come on, Sin, figure it out. Okay, so it finishes here, goes back up. If I could just have the whole bus loop on itself, that would be actually really good for me instead of having to, having to basically run one on each side, technically. I hope Kiwi's okay. Last time I went through an earthquake, I woke up in the middle of the night, whole house was shaking. Mm. Thought a train crashed down at the end of the street, because about a block away was railroad tracks. I just shook my head, went back to sleep. Woke up the next morning and saw the morning news, talking about a 3.5 or something earthquake. Oh, man, that's crazy. I haven't been in an earthquake in a long time. I've been in a bunch of, you know, monsoons and, and, uh, uh, I've been in two hurricanes. We were stupid back in the day, went out to Galveston, um, when we were living, when I was living in Texas. We are meeting a bunch of guy, our friends, and we were like, hey, let's go out there and hang out. It's gonna be great. Okay, cool. Let's do that. And then we drive all the way out there. None of us pay attention, right? We were, I think we were in our uh, late teens, early 20s. None of us are paying attention to the damn new, to the radio or the news. Why won't you let me connect that one? Okay, there it is. Here, there, there, here. Um, and, uh, so we get all the way to, to Corpus Christi, Texas, out by Galveston. We're on the beach, and it gets all quiet. And, you know, you can see the sky, and I'm like, oh, man, well, I was hoping we were all, it's, it's Texas, so you're really hoping that it's, that it's gonna be okay. Um, oops, I probably shouldn't have done that one. Let's go back, can I, okay. All right, let's go back to that. That'll work. Where's it flipping around at? It just flips around inside of the park. Okay, that's... I want to see how that runs, actually, now. Wait, what? Line. Create a bus line, which I did connect the line. Adding new stops. You can add more stops to any line you've already created. Place one stop or station where you wish to go. Select the bus line tool. Grab the existing line at the nearest point and then drag. So, pretty similar to what it was before. Did I just point a waypoint there? I did. Oh, right, that'll work. No, I don't want that. How do I get rid of that? Oh, maybe it'll tell me. Uh, 
All lines will stay on at the stop and adjust according to the new location. You can select stop in the lines information. We're moving them with the bulldozer. Okay, so down. Uh, how do I do that then? Or, okay, we're not doing that then. Rerouting bus lines. If you'd like your line to follow a different path from the one that is automatically created, <clears throat> you can add waypoints to the line. Waypoints won't pick up passengers. See, that's that was kind of needed too. They won't pick up passengers and don't need bus stops, but they're there to adjust the route the buses take. So maybe if you have multiple uh, depots, like in, say, T TTD or Transport Fever, and you have to send the bus back to the depot because it's not running nearly as efficiently as it as it was, you know, uh, earlier in the month. Then that might be beneficial to help keep maintenance down or maintenance costs down, uh, just because it gets checked every time it heads back to the depot. Maybe that's part of the another reason why. Plus, it allows you just to have to be more a more organic um, bus uh, routing and and bus lines themselves. You can continue to add more waypoints by dragging and dropping them. Oh, come on. Give me a second. <clears throat> Again, my eyes are starting to burn, guys. I'm probably going to end it, uh, wrap it up here really quickly. No worries. We'll see. We will see. I'm not done yet. I haven't given up yet. All right, so there's that one. The game is still paused. Where do we put the depot? Put the depot right here. I want to see. I want to see this. I want to see the bus come out. Actually. Um, pa unpause. Okay, they are snow covered. So that is something to consider. Those are cool looking. Let's speed time up. I may have to take some of the lighting out of uh, the the stop uh, the traffic lights out too. Oh, I do like these buses. Wait, go back. The bus stop. Oh, okay, that one's not a good one to look at. What about this one? Wow, those are kind of fancy, actually. Now, in the ones I'm used to, I used to live in Phoenix, Arizona. Um, this back plate um, behind the, where the little uh, the bench is for you to sit down, that back plate usually is just corrugated metal that has the holes in it, right? And then the whole, because the whole frame is just going to be it's metal itself. This one seems to be glass with like an aluminum ground. What does it say? It says Colossal Avenue and Chirps. Whoa, really? Oh, okay, that's not the match. That doesn't match this. Colossal Avenue and Chirp Street. Maybe it's for an advertisement. Someone on this side? No. Alright, go back to the bus. No, go back to the bus. I want to see people get on. <laughs> wow. Conga line. Is she just going to skip it? Oh, that's cool. All right, go back and add the time. And I like how on the left, I'm not sure if you can see it or not, but on the left, it shows the circuit and the highlighted blue, which is now nearly at the very apex top uh, of the line itself. That turnaround is not as weird as I thought it was gonna be. Still nobody's riding. So maybe this is like, oh, there it goes. People getting on. Woo. First bus riders in the city. And there goes the snow, and the snow is back. 
And there's a dog on board. This will hopefully help us. It actually, we didn't lose a lot of money by putting that in, surprisingly. So I think we can afford the, uh, tr the taxi depot on top of that. But I think we're still probably going to end up putting that second line in that I was discussing anyway. However, I, I can only, I'm probably going to go in about 10 minutes. Just, just round it off at that point and, and, and end up at the end of the hour. I want to thank everybody for, for tuning in today. Um, thank you to all the people who joined me for voice chat. Steven Eddington, D Diavante, SK99, uh, Maxi Bloke was here. I know that uh, Delta1246 was here. That Z Sock Z Spock Z was here. Uh, Proet Planes, one of the um, old people who used to watch the original Catterday streams, was here. We could probably slow the speed back down now. Doesn't need to go that fast now that I know it's working. Let's go back over here. Talk to this and get rid of the HUD. And let's try that. Let's see how this looks. Ooh, that's not bad at all. Let's grab that screenshot. <clears throat> Water looks pretty decent over here. People getting off. I like the fact that the buses will miss or will skip. I do like that very, very much because in City Skylines 1, they wouldn't. They would just set up like a conga line waiting to pick up all the, you know, at the same bus stop. Now, if you didn't, if you had a lot of people, which you had unrealistic amounts of people who would sit at a bus stop, and I'm sure that'll probably happen in this game too, to a certain degree. Um, then it would have worked out because the buses only hold like 30 people. So the first bus would fill up, drive off, the second bus would be there to pick up the next 30 people. Um, but that being said, um, I think everybody else I may have missed as far as coming in. I'm going to try to uh, stream tomorrow. Today's Friday. Have a happy and safe Friday. I will prob I'm not sure it's going to be a Catterday stream in the traditional sense, but it will be a Saturday stream. Uh, it'll probably be about 3 or 4 o'clock today like it, this one was. Um, if you liked anything down below, please don't forget to chat. Maybe a comment down below. Let me know if there's things that you feel I could do better. If you need something or want something named after you, let me know what you'd like named after you, and I will name it. There's still a lot of assets available. But regardless of all of that, have a happy and safe one. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you next time. Catch you later, Sin. I gotta go make dinner. Yeah, I was gonna try to do it. My eyes are burning so bad. <laughs> so bad. Oh, no. All right. You have eye drops? No, unfortunately. I don't... Well, I, we probably do. I don't know where she's got them. And so... I will figure that out. I'm wearing uh, the gunner glasses. So at least they're not burning as bad as they could. But... I get I get ver I get anxiety and um, probably shouldn't be saying all this on stream. <laughs> oh, well, I don't care. I get anxiety and my, and uh, I get really hungry and my eyes burn because I'm you know obviously especially like with this I'm not using it's a it's a two it's a 1440 screen, but because if I'm streaming it in 1080, the actual game is also currently in 1080, so it's using a small portion of the screen. For me to be able to see better, I kind of have to lean forward, and I shouldn't for my back, but I do, and I've got bad posture accordingly. So all of those things combined, plus the arthritis, playing with the keyboard, and then switching back between the uh, controller, and just me not being basically out of, quote, stream shape, I guess, ultimately, right? <laughs> I don't know. I, I've been told that this is all a hobby anyway, so... I'm hoping I can eventually, uh, I actually, I made money, so it's not fully a hobby. Uh, I, somebody tipped me, uh, di uh, Delta1246 tipped me the last stream. So it's not a hobby at that point. Once you make money, is it still a hobby? I don't know. Either way, have a <laughs> You go enjoy your meal. I got to go grab deliveries and uh, prepare our meal for, or plan our meal for tomorrow. And maybe screw around a little bit more on my other city or start a new city um, similar to this one and go slow without unlimited so that I can play behind the scenes and learn a little bit more and really just focus on it. Um, I just want to be able to teach people and, and have a good time. Have a happy and safe one, guys. I'll talk to you later.
Tá na.